I am Nisham. Today I am uh, explaining some topic from the mathematics which is the differential equation. So before starting the differential equation, I will little bit uh, explain the differentiation. Suppose we have the uh, mathematical equation y equal to fx. That is the, there are two terms, x which is the independent of any function that's so that is the independent variable and y which is depend upon the x so y is the dependent variable so for the differentiation so that is the dy by dx that is the derivative of dependent variable with respect to independent variable that is the f dash x so in class 11 uh, people are study difference, differentiation so so f fx is transformed into the f dash x now uh, today uh, from in differential equation we have to uh, study about how f dash x is transferred in fx so suppose uh, we have the differential equation which is formed like that manner suppose the y dy by dx plus x equal to 0 suppose this is the there are in independent independent variable dependent variable and also the function which is the derivative of derivative function with respect to x so this is the one equation which is called the differential equation Suppose we have the equation x plus y equal to 0. This is the equation which is form the dependent variable and independent variable. And this equation which is formed with the some differentiation term, derivative term also. That's why this mathematical equation is called as the differential equation. So before uh, studying the solution of the differential equation, we have to know about the formation of the differential equation. So we have to start the formation of the formation of the differential equation. So uh, our main aim to the formation of the differential equation to eliminate the constant or the parameter. So suppose we have the one function y equal to a sin x plus c. So we have to try to differentiate it for this function y equal to a sin x plus c and we have to eliminate a and c. So let us start suppose our differentiation of differentiate y with respect to x. So dy by dx equal to a cos x plus c. Now again differentiate it. So d2y by dx square equal to minus a sin x plus c. So we see uh, y equal to a sin x plus c and the double derivative of this equation come minus a sin x plus c. So the addition of these two equations, equation 1 and equation 2, so come that, that will come d2y by dx square plus y equal to 0. That is the formation for differential mathematical equation which is formed in the differential term. That is the differential equation. We have to eliminate A and C also. Now we have to take one more example. Suppose we have the family of the circle having a center is origin and radius is R. So the family of circle is the x square plus y square equal to R square. Now we use the differentiation and try to find out the differential equ equ equation form of the family of circle having radius r and center origin. Now differentiate it this equation. So 2x plus 2y dy by dx equal to 0. So we eliminate r is the constant or parameter. So we eliminate r by using the differentiation. So the, this equation dy by dx equal to minus x upon y this is the differential equation form of the arbitrary circle having center is the origin and radius r now start to explain the order and degree of the differential equation so let us start the order of the differential equation So the order of the differential equation, the maximum order of derivative of the equation that is the y equal to fx. So suppose we have to take one example, uh, that is the, this is example, the 3y by dx cube 
plus d2 y by dx square plus y equal to zero. So here the maximum order of derivative that is the three. This term, this term. So this is the maximum order of derivative that is three. So the order is three. That is the order. So suppose we have and the another term is the degree. Degree of differential equation. So now degree degree is the the power of the maximum order of derivative. Suppose we have one example. We have to taking one example degree. Uh, that is the d three y by d x cube to power five plus d two y by d x square whole power six plus y equal to zero. So here the power five and six and the order is three and two. But we have to explain in the definition the degree is the uh, maximum power of the maximum order of the differential equation. So the maximum order of this differential equation is three. So power of this one is the five. So the degree of this differential equation is five. And also the order of this is differential equation is three because the maximum order of derivative. So order is three. Now. Start the solution of the differential equation. So we start to first the linear differential equation. So we start first linear differential equation. So first is the variable separable method. So the variable separable method, we have to separate the variable in two terms. Suppose we have in differential equation dy by dx equal to f x into g y. So here there are the two type of variable. The variable of x, a function of x, which is the vari x variable, and fun function of y, that is the y variable. So we have to separate it. How to separate the this equation? So suppose this is the one upon g y d y equal to f of x d x. This is the separated. Now integrate this differential equation and find out the capital G y. That is the integral form of a small g y equal to capital F of x plus c. That is the solution of by using the variable separable method of this type of differential equation. Let us take one example of the variable separable method. So the variable separable and suppose the x dy upon dx plus y equal to zero. So we have to separate it in individual variable. So x dy upon dx equal to minus y. So uh, one upon y dy equal to minus one upon x dx and integrate it. So ln y equal to minus ln x plus c. So that is also you take uh, only take to c. So ln x y equal to c or ln c that is the x y equal to constant. That is the solution of the. Differential equation. This differential equation having the variable separable method. Now again, uh, we have to try to explain the homogeneous differential equation. Second, so the homogeneous differential equation. So this is the homogeneous differential equation. Homogeneous means suppose uh, f x. In terms of y in term or y or f x in terms of f of x plus y sine or cos of y by x or x plus y by x minus y. When the differential equation suppose that dy by dx equal to f of x. So when a dif the differential equation dy by dx equal to fx and fx in the form of x plus y, y by x or x by y, so this type of differential equation is called homogeneous differential equation. 
so the solution of the differential homogeneous differential equation is that manner suppose we have equation dy upon dx equal to f of y upon x so this type of differential equation solving of this type of differential equation take y equal to vx and difference v is also one parameter so we have to taking y equal to vx and differentiate it dy upon dx equal to v plus x dv upon dx and this equation is put in the above equation one so v plus x dv upon dx equal to f of v since f of y upon x equal to f of vx by x that is x is cancelled out so f of v so f of v now x dv upon dx equal to f of v minus v that is after that we solve this differential equation by using the separable variable method so 1 upon f of v minus v dv equal to 1 by x dx and integrate v so this type of differential equation solved by this method so this is the homogeneous differential equation again we try to explain the reducible to the homogeneous differential equation suppose the differential is reducible to the homogeneous equation reducible to homogeneous differential equation suppose the differential equation dy by dx in terms of x plus y plus 5 divided by x minus y plus 3 and right now this is not a homogeneous difference because the power of x and y is 1 but this term is a constant so our main aim to eliminate this constant so we have to take the small x equal to capital x plus h and a small y equal to capital y plus k so dy by dx equal to capital d y by d capital x now this equation this is the this equation small x equal to x plus h in a small y equal to y plus k put in the above equation now d capital y by dx equal to a capital x plus h plus capital y plus k plus 5 divided by capital x plus h minus capital Y plus K plus 3. After that solving this equation dy by dx equal to x plus y divided by x minus y and that term uh, h plus k plus 5 equal to 0 and h minus k plus 3 equal to 0. So by this two equation we have to find out the value of h and k so we know the value of h can so for that value this term it becomes zero so after this equation we have to try to solve it so from the homogeneous equation we have to solve this type of equation so we have to put y equal to vx and differentiate it and again solve by the homogeneous method now so after that reducible to homogeneous method we try to discuss about the linear differential equation so the linear differential equation so the linear difference, differential equation when the differential equation in the form of dy by dx plus py equal to q where p and q are either constant or the function of x so this type the solution of this type of linear differential equation we have to first find the integrating factor that is the if that is the e to the power integration of px d sorry p dx and the solution of this type of differential equation is the y into integrating factor equal to integration of q into integrating factor dx plus c so this is the linear differential equation so we have to take one example suppose we have taken the one example y dy by dx equal to sorry dy by dx minus 
y by x equal to x square. So here a uh, p equal to minus one by x and q equal to x square. So integrating factor is e to the power integration of minus one by x dx. So so that is the e to the power minus ln x that is the one by x. Now the solution of this type of differential equation is the one by x into y equal to integration of x square into one by x dx plus c that is y upon x equal to that is x so x square by two plus c. Now. Uh, so that's it. This is the linear differential equation. Again, we try to uh, define the exact differential equation. Sorry, Bernoulli differential equation. 